Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video I will show you a game between Julia Rianova and Daniel Melamed. This is a game from the Australian Chess Championship 2024. The game from the round 7. Julia Rianova had white pieces and she started with d4. Daniel Melamed played knight to f6. c4, e6. Going for the Nimso Indian defense. Maybe. Knight to f3. And now instead of bishop to b4. d5. Queen's gambit declined. Knight to c3, and only now, bishop to b4. The Ragozin defense. Queen to b3, a5, bishop to g5, knight to c6, a3, a4, queen to c3, bishop takes knight check, white to move. Queen takes bishop was expected, b takes on c3 was played. This may not be stronger than queen takes on c3. h6, asking a question, bishop to h4, d takes on c4, e4, g5, bishop to g3, b5, defending the pawn on c4. Black is the pawn up. h4, g4, knight to e5, bishop to b7, and black is doing well. It is white to move. White would love to play bishop to e2. Queen to e2 was played. Well, a bishop to e2 doesn't work because of knight takes on e5. And after bishop takes on e5, bishop takes on e4. Let's play a few more moves. Bishop takes on f6, bishop takes on c2, bishop takes on d8. Rook takes on d8, bishop takes on g4, bishop to e4. Black is a pawn up and stands better. Back to our game. In this position, we have queen to e2. It is black to move, and in this position, black has a few good moves. Which moves are good? Well, knight to e5 is not a bad move. Knight takes on e5 is also a good move after bishop takes on e8. Rook to g8. Black is doing well. But there was a total surprise in this position. Daniel Melamed played knight takes on d4. This is the most shocking reply. c takes on d4, queen takes on d4, rook to d1, queen to c3 check, queen to d2. Black to move. In this position Melamed considered queen takes on a3 and didn't like that move so he Traded queens, queen takes on d2, check, rook takes on d2, bishop takes on e4. Black has four pawns for a piece. Rook to b2, defending the pawn with c6. White to move. White wants to activate the light skilled bishop, but then there is a problem on g2. Knight takes on c4 was played. Let's take it back if f3, one line goes like this. Knight to h5, bishop to f2. G takes on f3, G takes on f3, bishop to d5, and this is good for black. Back to our game. So in this position we have knight takes on c4, b takes on c4, bishop to e5, king to e7, rook to b7, check, knight to d7, bishop takes rook, rook takes bishop, king to d2, if bishop takes on c4, bishop takes on g2. So we have king to d2, king to d6, bishop takes on c4, bishop takes on g2, rook to d1, f5, king to e3, check, not from the king, from the rook, bishop to d5, rook to b4, rook to a8, bishop to d3, knight to c5, Bishop to c2, rook to f8, white to move, rook to a1 was played. The rook is ready to support the future pass pawn on a3. The game continued. e5, bishop takes on a4, f4 check, king to e2, bishop to f3 check, king to f1, g3, bishop to d1, bishop to d5, f3 black to move how would you continue 
Daniel Melamed played e4. This is the best move. King to g2, and now knight to d3. And this knight is now a monster. It is white to move. Rook takes on e4 was played. Let's take it back. If something like rook to d4, then knight to e1 check, and after king to f1, knight takes on f3. Back to our game, that is why in this position, Julia played rook takes on e4. Bishop takes on e4, f takes on e4, knight to e1 check, king to h3, g2, king to h2, f3. Bishop takes on f3, rook takes bishop, e5 check, king to e6, rook to c1, rook to f1, rook takes on c6, king takes on e5, rook to g6, knight to f3 check. Well, uh, rook to h1 has some good points too, like after the king goes to g3 you push the pawn. This is not a bad idea. Back to our game. Daniel wanted to torture his opponent for longer and played knight to f3 check. King takes on g2. Black played the move and white resigned and the move is rook to g1. Julia Ariano resigned in view of this continuation. King takes knight. Rook takes rook. Wow, that was a well played game by Daniel Melamed. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.